Hello students, welcome to Soro Soro classes. For detailed information about our classes, you can just visit our website that is www.sorosoclasses.com and for other doubts and queries, you can call us or WhatsApp us at this number 9836-793076. You can even like our videos and subscribe our channel for further more videos. Today we are solving some problems on work, power and energy and our first question is a bob of mass M, here the mass is M, is suspended by a massless string of length L, length is L. The horizontal velocity V at position A is just sufficient to make it reach the point B. The angle theta at which the speed of the bob is half of that at A and it satisfies here this figure is given and four options are also given and the options are A theta is equals to pi by 4 B theta is greater than pi by 4 and less than pi by 2 C is pi by 2 less than theta less than 3 pi by 4 and D is 3 pi by 4 less than theta less than pi so now let's proceed to the solution here we can write that v is equals to root over 5 g l and mark it as first equation now we can also write v by 2 whole square is equals to v square minus 2 g h this is our second equation and we can also write h is equals to l into 1 minus cos theta and mark it as our third equation. So now solving the equation 1, 2 and 3 we can get that cos theta is equals to minus 7 by 8 theta is equals to cos inverse minus 7 by 8 that is 151 degree so here option D that is 3 pi by 4 less than theta less than pi is our correct answer Now let's proceed to the next question and the question is a particle of mass m here the mass of the particle is given that is m is moving in a circular path of constant radius that is r such that its centripetal acceleration that is ac is verifying time t as ac is equals to k square rt square it is given that AC is equals to K square RT square where K is a constant. The power delivered to the particle by the force acting on it is and four options are given and the options are 2 pi M K square R square. Second option is M K square R square T. Third is M K to the power 4 R square T to the power 5 whole divided by 3 and D is zero now it's a very important question and we can see that it was in 1994's paper so and it's a very easy question so now let's proceed to the answer it is given in the question that ac is equals to here ac is equals to k square r t square or v square by r is equals to k square r t square as ac is equals to v square by r or we can rewrite it as v is equals to k r t therefore the tangential acceleration that is AT is equals to dv 
by dt that is equals to kr or the force ft is equals to m at that is equals to m kr only the tangential force does work here so we can write that power that is ft into v is equals to m k r we are just putting the value of ft and v so it is m k r into k r t or we can say that the power is equals to m k square r square t so here option b that is m k square r square t is the correct answer